Let's see, so are we still rescuing the young lord? Kinda? I mean, we're very much just murder monstering as much as we can. And we're vaguely looking for our young lord. I'm sure if we were an actual shinobi, we'd just take a direct path. But as it, as it stands, we're just like, oh, I don't know, let's just go this direction. And there's all sorts of stuff all over the place. It's actually kind of, I'm not going to say exactly frustrating. Uh, but you really think this character would have an intimate knowledge of everything around us. Like, you'd think he'd know some of these people. Like, he doesn't? Like, I think it would almost be cooler if, uh... And maybe this is actually the case. Uh, it, it would almost be cooler if... Oh. You're just one of the Rocketeers. Oh, let's see. It'd almost be cooler if he knew every single person and they betrayed him. And, you know, he was much more on a path of... Path of Vengeance, or who knows what. But, like, as it stands, all of these characters that we've run into so far seem to have no idea who our, our main boy is here. Oh, there was that one upper guy that just totally ignored me. Whatever, that's fine. And, you know, because we seem to know who Lady Butterfly was. But we never learned anything about it. Let's see, is there still grinding in this game? Not really, no. I see your spears. And I'm in trouble. Leaving. I didn't take any falling damage from that, but I managed to uh, get rid of the other guy. Come back a bit. Oh. Well, that's these guys kind of suck. Glad I got rid of that other one. There we go. Cripes! I don't really know how you're supposed to fight that guy. Ah, oh, shit, and they're all over the place. At least there's only one this time. Oh, this one doesn't have a hat, though. Wait, no. He's got the same goddamn hat.
Okay, you want to do another one of those... One of those flips? Okay. So, effectively, Lady Butterfly Tactics. I had a low strike like these guys. Oy. Okay, yeah, we've got a checkpoint right on the other side of this. Oh, good. The door's open. Hello. I don't know who you are, but I'm gonna rest. Because these guys suck. Who boy. This game does not pull punches. Ask about the special holy person. I'm told that a special holy person lives here. Remarkably holy. That would be the child, I imagine. She's not here anymore. It's my fault. The child. She's confined within the inner sanctum. It's impossible to see her now. I see. Uh, are you... A shinobi. Mm. Mm. If that's the case, then actually, I have a favor to ask of you. The child wanted to know the reason for her fate. If you do see her by some chance, please give her this. It's the least I can do for my own atonement. Holy chapter infested. For an age, I have been blessed by the worm. To be undying is to walk the eternal path to enlightenment. Thus, I must become enlightened to understand why I cannot die. If it is said the holy dragon's origins were in the west, so I wonder how did the worm come to be bestowed upon me? All right. So yeah, he's got like weird worm centipede things, just like all the other weird priests that we've run into so far. I don't like it. I really don't like it. But I don't think I have much of a choice in the matter. Oh. Let's see, is there an item on the statue? You can see a golden light on it. Yes, there is. Yeah, and I just ran over my controller cord. Okay, so let's uh let's see if we can get up there. I just wanted to be near the checkpoint. Oh, dragon's blood droplet. Heck yeah. Anything else here? We can go up. Let's see. We can go up. We also can fight these guys. Which I really don't want to do. I don't think they actually have anything to drop for me. Mainly just the pellet. Because these guys are all pukey. I think otherwise, not exactly harmless, but they don't follow. I'm just gonna wander aimlessly. Let's we'll see. There's an item in there. How do we get over there? Yeah, you just keep puking. Yeah, I don't see a way in from here. 
Hmm. So whatever it is, it has nothing to do with these guys. We do also have a bit. Oh, Bessie. I don't want to fight one of those guys, let alone three. I'm just going to skip them. Hey, whatever's in that, like, intersection. Hmm. I'm just going to keep running. Hopefully Hatman Stan won't come come with me. I don't want to deal with that yet. That's a lot of fire. You know, for dudes with giant claws on their hands, they don't really fight. They just burn. I guess they do have, like, a silly amount of firebombs attached to them, so I guess it's not that surprising. Okay, so we've got that little nook there. We've got the one danger dude. We can go up and we can go down. Well, it looks like it down is valid on both counts. So what do we got over here? I'm kind of floored I haven't actually run into an official boss fight. I guess it kind of almost makes sense. Have a bunch of smaller, lighter bosses and then make your, your actual bosses much more tremendous in a way. Because the two bosses I did fight were pretty standouty comparatively. Interesting how much time we can go in a uh... how much how far you can go without uh there we go. I find honestly just bullying those guys into submission works the best. Now is there Oh, hello. Oh, all of these are these weird monks. Okay. The worm, the blessed, blessed by the worms. I Man, I don't even know how to describe these guys. Uncomfortable, deeply uncomfortable is really the word. I guess I go with it, but still. More lizards? We got more lizards! I have a very aggressive style. Uh, let's see. Is that... Okay. Oh, so that's how we get probably back to the top. They're all self-mummied. They're sort of self-mummied. The thing is, though, they've got... they got worms crawling all over them. So, a little bit more than just self-mummied. Senpu Esoteric task, Text. Those of the Senpo Temple mastered martial arts in the pursuit of virtue. They considered strong fist and strict discipline essential against Buddha's enemies. However, Senpu Temple was seized by an obsession for the undying, which corrupted the teachings and style. I really like the skill system in this game. It's honestly a lot more fun than just the, the old stats. That Dark Souls did. And admittedly, like, the stat system was kind of nice. You could build interesting builds and whatnot. But a lot of it just had to do with your weapon of choice. What was the point of this?
Oh, I see. I bet if we took the drop down here, maybe it would drop me somewhere else. Maybe and we'll see. That or I've missed a path. No. I guess that just gets me the Sempo esoteric text, which is kind of nice, but still. Uh, but, like, I think this is the first Souls, like, I've actually really felt like, yeah, you can kind of customize your character in a way that isn't just statistical. And I actually like that a lot more. It's a lot more interesting this way, even if, you know, a lot of it is still fairly linear of just like, okay, this just is more on the poise damage and stuff. Um... But, like, it's nice when my decisions aren't just, like, slightly more damage. Because with Dark Souls, you could almost just get rid of the whole stat scaling system. Leveling entirety and just more or less make your entire build based on the weapon that you're currently using. Heck, you could even get rid of the weapon upgrading system, and I'd say it's still probably performed perfectly well. Yeah, so whatever it is, we're supposed to... I guess we're supposed to still be in here. I took a wrong turn? I don't know. I guess there's that section I might not have looked at. Oh, let's see. I only have one skill point. What else do we do? I guess I can take a look at it. So we got the temple arts. Using successful, uh, successive elbow and arm strikes, unleash a flurry of quick attacks that inflict damage while preventing a counterattack. The strikes are both a martial art and a form of prayer. Well, unfortunately we're going to have to wait on that one. I haven't been getting as many skill points now. Yeah, did I? I just never went this direction, did I? Cripes. Nothing about you is good. I guess this is undying. I really think you could at least kill the centipede. I don't see anything else. Okay, let's go back and heal. I feel like we're gonna have to fight a bunch of those things. We should probably get some more. F we should probably put the fire thing on my bar. Uh, let's get rid of the axe, probably, in favor of flame vent. Because these guys are super weak to fire, comparatively. Does not open from the side. Subtle. Boop. You're blessed of the worm! I am blessed of fire! Ow. I am beginning to feel like I'm not going to like this place. Is there actually a reason? Oh. There's a reason to go this direction. What the fat wax? Now, is this where I wanted to go the entire time? Kinda. Yeah, it looks, it looks like this is where I've been looking to go. Another bundled Jizo statue. Those are nice. Still haven't found... Let's see. I still haven't found any... Uh, look up. Kinda? Is that... No, that's nothing. Yeah, so that is where I wanted to go. 
Doesn't really look like there's anything immediately useful here. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to figure out where to go. But yeah, what do I think of this game so far? It is both the hardest Souls-like I think I've ever played and ever will. Well, not ever will play. But like... Dark Souls is pretty freaking hard. Hmm. I guess we should probably talk to this guy again. See what he has to say. Is there this temple? Hmm. So you're the one who works for the divine heir of the dragon's blood. That's right. The divine heir is truly exalted. But exalted or not, man is still man. Oh, I'm so foolish that I didn't understand that myself. Don't. Don't leave your divine heir on his own. Leave. It's too late to regret once you've already lost them. Is there this temple? Mm. So that's the right. devotics. Hmm. Bye. not finding what I'm looking for here because there's a door there's a door I can't open so clearly I should be able to get further into this because yeah I was back here Might be a higher level on that one. Because, yeah, if I sneak, there's a door right there that I can't open. Which means something. Tell if you guys know where I should be walking on this one. It's like I can keep going up. I don't see anything up here. Just like in a little upper section, nothing more. Can you get there via the backside? I kind of tried. Because this is the quote-unquote back side. Let's see. I don't see an easy way to get there. Like, I look at this and I'm like, this is probably where I'm supposed to go. Can I ask for some directions? Not from him. Anything behind these guys? No, it doesn't look like there's anything but spooks up in the rafter. Oh. That was interesting. Oh. I can just jump attack these dudes. Yeah, maybe you can get there from swinging across. Maybe. Because, like, it feels like this is probably progress. I, I just can't seem to find a path that doesn't just take me back to where I've already been. 
Anyway, so I do. Do I think this is better than Bloodborne or Dark Souls or anything like that? I mean, no matter what, it's a hard sell. The question is like, what do you prefer? I like the fact that this game has a lot of verticality to it. Uh, so you're not just like walking through a standard level, kind of carefully fighting mobs and you know trying very hard not to die. This is a little bit more fast, aggressive. In a lot of cases, you know, you're... You're kind of trying to not let your enemy have much of a gap to wail on, the, uh, wail on you and stuff like that. Okay. There must be something in here. Maybe? I don't know. Worst comes to worst, I just clear it out. We try this again and who knows? It looks like there's nothing over here that I can get to. It's like a bunch of trees, but that's about it. And I can't go up this pagoda. This pagoda is small and iffy. And launching myself with this tree doesn't actually get me up. Some hell of a pagoda, though. Yeah, that's the way I came out of. I'm actually kind of lost here. I mean, technically I can just go to a different zone, but I was kind of hoping I could at least... Plonk myself before the boss here. Maybe do a couple attempts, realize that, yeah, it's, it's bullshit too. Yeah, that's where the text was. What I'm looking for is an entrance further in. And yeah, the... Second path in the cave just leads to where the drop is. Yeah. Yeah, and we already got the item there. Because this is that first entrance. There's nothing here. And then we have this locked door, which does not open from the side. I, well. Yeah, I don't see anything else in here. You can tell you if you want to know. Yeah, yeah. I I am actually quite stuck at this point. So unless there's like some other pathway that I've totally missed here, I my alternatives are just leave. Ugh. makes no sense. No human being should be able to do this. But I can! There's nothing else right here. You need to find Kuro, then come back here. Oh, okay. Well, that's important. Where the heck is Kuro? Uh... You know, we actually never did clear... Ashina Castle. We... We were, like, lurking around 
we killed some dudes, and then I was just like, ooh, reservoir and dungeon, and then just got super lost down those directions. I... Let's see. Ow. Aha! It worked! Ow. Oh, these guys don't have fancy drop attack business. Okay, so let's just check out this area. It does not open from the side, surprising no one. Oh. Item I missed. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, yeah, go figure. Yep. Ow. Wow. Take less falling damage? Or no falling damage? Okay. Cool. Yeah, I forgot to keep going up. Okay. Every time I try and get a hidden on one of these guys, it just doesn't it just doesn't track in the way I want it to. Okay, so let's let's try that again. I'm just gonna go back and heal. And we're just going to try that again, knowing that there's a buttload more ninjas up there than I thought. I was assuming there was just a handful, but no, there's there is a there is a metric butt ton of ninjas up on this rooftop. What are they called? They're not the owls. There's another name for them. I forget. Probably get better at fighting them. But yeah, it's the rooftops with the smoke. Well, that didn't go great. Hmm. Dang it. Let's ledge hang, drop down. Okay, here we go. Surprise. I want his weapon. Okay, here he is. I don't think I get much of a choice. was a decent opportunity that I've since squandered. That's okay. There we go. I gotta remember I can quick spear enemies, which actually does- Oh! There's another one! I didn't even notice you. Okay. Keep on the offensive. There we go. Because, yeah, I can I can chain spear, spear thrusts into regular sword hits. Uh, let's see. Try pushing them off. It doesn't work in this game. Nobody takes fall damage from what I've encountered. Kind of sucks a bit.
Okay, there goes one. So they have friends. Whoop. Okay, we're good. God, I love this spear. It is effective. Where's the next one? There you are. Morning. Let's see, there is fall damage. For the player, yes. Maybe for the enemies, but in general, I've never... I've never been able to knock anybody from anything and actually have it do anything. Like, uh, who did I... I, I knocked off one of those, like... Uh... Call him Big Spear Guys. Oh, there you are. You thought you were hunting me, were you? But yeah, I pushed one of the staff guys and it did like a quarter of his health and damage. It was lackluster. I was expecting it to do considerably more. Some more of these lizards. I ain't afraid of no lizard creature. But yeah, so pushing enemies off doesn't work. It's also not like a valid tactic. Uh, also like, I know it seems like it would be kind of a neat thing to include in this game, but unless you see me doing it, chances are it's not like much of a thing in the game. So like kicking enemies off or doing like weird tricks. Oh, you're still alive. How are you still alive? How do you still exist around here? Oh. That... I'm sorry. That seems hardly fair. There we go. And ninjas don't fight fair. I know, but getting one shot by just like a random random enemy in this game is not fun. As on New Game Plus is bullshit strong. Yeah, I can imagine. Ow. Why did I why do I do the things that I do? Now is there anything I can do to muck up their kite business? Why do they have the kite there? I don't know. No. Nope. Not supposed to be able to do that. Ah, there we go. Hey, we get a shrine too. Oh, stop. What do we get from this? Sword seed. Yes. So the kites are a later later thing. Interesting. Well, we might as well rest. We don't have anything else. We don't have enough skill points to afford much. Random samurai in here. All right. Well, they go down fast. Hello. Random samurai my ass. Charge. Who are you? What are you? I don't know, but you're dying. Nice view, isn't it? Everybody dies. Oh, 
Okay. So these guys are going to be a little tougher. I should probably actually practice fighting them instead of just one-shotting them from behind. But it's pretty satisfying. Charge still sticks to stealth. Dude, I... You know it. Let's see. Have I, been down, I haven't been down there yet. Eh, let's keep going up. Let's see. Do we have anything fancy in here? No, we just have this, like, up nook. That I feel like I should probably look for. Fashion sugar... You know, last time I went through one of these, I found a horror centipede man. There we go. I'm getting better at the Mikiri counters. Now that I know that these guys do them. Let's see. Anything else here? No, but we have a door I can open. Hello, corpses. Hmm. All that fresh blood. Ooh, look. Croutons. Excuse me. Don't mind me, just here for my ritualistic bloodletting. Ow. I gotta wait for this to come back. Well, when in doubt. Oh! Hi! Just keep that in mind. Uh, keep that in mind for later. Looks like there's more of the weird, like, crow ninja things all over the place. I have up here. We have a memory. And another checkpoint. Wow. They're just everywhere in here. Lady Emma, tell me, what has caused the state of this man? The rejuvenating waters. That is what it is called. Are you telling me that this is Ashina's secret weapon? I am. Those who drink it cannot fully die. No. They become unable to die at all. The rejuvenating water, it also... It springs from the dragon's blood, does it not? Yes. Lady Emma... I do not believe the dragon's blood is sacred. Not at all. Let's see. Holy shit, you're good. I'm... I'd say I'm passable at this game. I... Maybe? I don't know. I'd have to start comparing with other people. I'm sure a billion people would disagree with you heavily on that one. So that's probably a boss. Let's see. We might as well go check whatever that other pathway is. Um. Hmm. About an hour and 20 minutes of fighting Lady Butterfly will make anyone good. Very true. Okay. Back off. Okay. Heal for a second. There we go. There we go. Chaining the spear is also incredibly effective. Let's see. So what do we got in here? 
Eel liver, gross. Miraculous drug capable of banishing lightning. Offered at the Ashina clan altar. Greatly reduces the amount of damage received from lightning attacks, as well as the shock stab status abnormality. Lightning is a force of the gods. Eels, while small, are relatives of dragons. Even a god's force can be suppressed. But probably not for long. And we get some more pellets. Well, where does this take me? Ishin's letter. A note left by Ishin in the watchtower. Perhaps Emma knows his current whereabouts. Dear Emma, the Ashina Castle gate has grown loud with the sound of scurrying. The Tengu will see to the rats. Worry not. Ishin. Aha! I've, I've escaped! I'm a free man! I guess technically we always had this. Hello. Oh. Means more Tengu. I see you down there. Wow. Oh, wait, no. We rested at a... We rested at a thing. There's a ton of things, but I don't want to go down. Not really. At least we've got bird's nest filled with... Sugar! No ninja? Oh, thank you. Get the bejeebus out of me for a second. Okay, whatever. Where can I go? Yeah, frame rate's getting kind of bad. Also, damn. Damn, that's a tall mountain. Is that a volcano? I get the feeling we're going there at some point over the course of this game, maybe. I love the verticality in this area. It feels fresh. I... That's one of my favorite features of this game. Is just, like, exploring feels good. I, it's always been true of Dark Souls games, but I feel like this feels better. Oh. Shit. It's probably Mount Fuji. Me? Yeah, no, because Mount Fuji is off on its own at all times. 